We are visiting today the McKinnon family farm, Oakstone, in the heart of the Waikato. This picturesque farm is set over 120 hectares of fertile land with varying heights. The McKinnons are milking 365 cows through their 32 bale rotary shed. Outside the shed is a feed pad that cleanses using flood wash. This drains into a wedge that acts as a separation dam. This then drains into a storage pond with a volume of 2.6 million litres. The dairy shed effluent is also gravity fed to the same wedge for processing before pond storage. The effluent system is a state-of-the-art Yardmaster configuration consisting of a 15 kilowatt three-stage self-priming pump, a 7.5 kilowatt shore mounted stirrer and two Williams travelling irrigators. The system has multiple actuator controlled discharge lines. Two are to fill the flood wash tanks. Two to go to the lower farm charge lines for irrigation on the relative flats. The final two lines are up over a 70 metre head to the top farm paddocks 1.5 kilometres away. While all this is clearly efficient and modern, the thing that really makes this system different is the Yardmaster Halo Super Smart Monitoring and Control System. This system not only controls all six lines and duties, it also monitors this through a cloud-based platform. So Rod McKinnon, as the farm owner, can see exactly what is happening on the farm and from any smart device, change and control what is happening. This system means the one Yardmaster pump can act as a transfer pump, alter its flow for the land conditions and maintain output, all while being recorded by the system. With GPS on the irrigator, proof of placement is given. The configurable dashboard is very simple and clear on its layout, and more importantly, easy to change settings on. You set what alerts and limits you want. Rod McKinnon explains why he went to the system and how he finds its use and benefits. Why did you go with the Yardmaster equipment and products? The whole concept of the multi-stage pump and its ability to change rates whenever I wanted at different times of the season really appealed to me. Then it came down to reliability, Yardmaster's been around for a long time. The service and local dealership for me was one of the biggies. You changed from a PLC base system to a halo system. What was the reasoning behind your decision? Well, what I liked about the halo system was that it, that it had real ability to monitor real time from any device, anywhere. I could be in Egypt monitoring exactly what was happening down on the farm. And that's great with having staff, you know, being able to know exactly what's happening when it's happening at the right times. How easy is it for you to see and control what is happening on your farm? Very easy. Anything around the pump workings, I can change at the touch of a button. Whether I'm sitting at home in my office or whether I'm down on the farm with my iPhone. And that just saves me having to go back to the system to turn it on and off. It's just a complete time saver for me. How has the Yardmaster Halo made compliance easier to manage? On the farm these days, certain environmental impact is, is really important and Sandra and I are trying to do our best to, to keep that low. And so being able to record and deliver that information back to my computer at home is easy with the Halo system because all of the information is there. At any given point, I can see what's happening. It's like having one boot on the ground while I'm still away fishing for the day. Would you recommend the Yardmaster Halo system to your fellow farmers? I definitely see. It's been a fantastic investment that we've made. It's a great system and it helps me stay compliant on the farm 24-7 and I believe it's the way of the future. So there you have it from Rod himself. The future of effluent management is here. And if you have not seen the Yardmaster Halo in action, maybe it's time you do.